What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Well, 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 Eddie Hearn does it again. I'm on Matchroom Boxing's verified Instagram page. Make sure you follow them. And he wasted no time. It was just announced the other day that Luis King Kong Ortiz was signing to Matchroom, and they already have his next fight. Crazy. This is a pretty stacked card. You have Jason Sosa, who just beat Javier Fortuna to become the WBA champion. He's going to fight Steven Smith, a guy with knockout power. You have Jamie McDonald, Arthur Abram, and Martin Murray in a rematch as the main event. I think this is the main event. And then also, brand new heavyweight signee with Matchroom, Luis King Kong Ortiz versus Malik Scott. And I believe they both fought Tony Thompson in their last bout, of course, Malik Scott's went the distance and King Kong Ortiz stopped him in brutal fashion and they said King Kong Ortiz tops huge Monte Carlo Bonanza so I guess that's the main event Matchroom Boxing and Casino de Monte Carlo are delighted to announce a blockbuster night of world championship boxing on November 12th blah blah one of the most dangerous and exciting heavyweights and they kind of just break down the fights this is big news, man. I told you guys Golden Boy really dropped the ball in losing Luis King Kong Ortiz and Eddie Hearn, and Matchroom Boxing, bravo, because they already got it cracking. This was just announced one day ago, and he's already back in action, whereas we haven't seen him since, I think it was March, when Saddam Ali and Jesse Vargas fought. He fought Tony Thompson, I believe, on that same card, and he's already back. And we, we haven't really seen him super active. And he needs to be based on his age and stuff. So, Matchroom getting it done. No complaints. Let me know what you guys think. Luis King Kong Ortiz versus Malik Scott. It should be a solid fight. Malik Scott, he's always working out. He's in good shape. Six foot four. He has two stoppage losses. His only two losses. One was to Deontay Wilder. It looked kind of fishy. A lot of people thought it was it was rigged because they're friends. But first round stoppage. And then he also lost to Derek Chisora. Let me know what you guys think. But you see the comments. Serious card right there. Good card. Great bill. And the UK fans are on fire. So shout out to Matchroom Boxing. Drop it in the comment section. Make sure you share the video. Like the video. As always, hate, comment, and subscribe to the next video. It's Ego Sunday.